Hello everyone. In this video we shall talk about interference of light which is the most important phenomenon that supporting the wave nature of light. And uh, before we start let us uh, first look at the superposition of two waves. When two waves superpose each other such a way the crest falls on crest and trough falls on trough they constructively interfere on the other side when the two waves interfere such a way the crest falls on trough they destructively interfere and when the waves destructively superpose the minimum intensity is formed and there are various effects of interference of light one of them is so bubbles colors on so bubbles and also the colors on the pe peacock feathers and also we see the brilliant colors on the oil film floating on the surface of water it's also due to interference of light and we shall see the interference of light demonstration with the help of the ripple tank experiment so this is a very effective way of uh, demonstrating the interference of light as you can see there is a lamp mounted on the top and there are two vibrators and uh, there is an arrangement of controlling the motor which in turn uh, produces vibrations on the surface of water that means it creates ripple that frequency can be controlled we have a shallow water tank here to pour water inside it uh, so that when the vibrator touches the surface then you can see the ripples created on the surface of the water so to see them clearly there is a white paper which is uh, placed under uh, the arrangement so that the ripples can be seen clearly we can see here only one vibrator is in touch with the surface of water and the circular ripples are clearly seen on the white sheet now let us see what would happen if both of the vibrators are in touch with the surface of water then uh, we can increase and decrease the frequency of the vibrations now we shall see what happens or what we can see on the surface of the white sheet here the two vibrators are in touch with the surface of water and they start vibrating simultaneously at the same time so these two are acting like two coherent sources meaning the two sources which produces the waves of same frequency or wavelength and without any phase difference between them or the constant phase difference between them so we shall see a wonderful interference pattern which is happening on the surface of water now so the waves generated due to the first source is interfering with the waves generated by the second source so as they interfere we can see the two waves with the various frequencies you can see the bright color band and dark color uh, regions are formed here so these are actually formed because of the superposition of crests and troughs when when crest falls on crest and trough falls on trough then you can see the constructive superposition happens and uh, consequently the bright bands are formed whereas when crest falls on trough and trough falls on crest they destructively superpose and you can see the uh, shadow region in the similar manner we can also explain the interference of light so the two sources two coherent sources emanating the light of same frequency with constant phase difference between them interfere with each other and on the screen you can see the bright and dark bands and this phenomenon of redistribution of energy of light when they coming out of the two coherent sources is known as interference of light so basically redistribution meaning with the bright and dark regions intensity is equally distributed so you can see it is actually in uh, in accordance with the conservation of energy principle 